the 22nd of November 2017 15H13 copyright AFPA Yemeni child suffering from diphtheria receives treatment at a hospital in the capital Sina on November 22nd 2017 HODEIDA Yemen AFP3 people have died of suspected diphtheria in conflict at Yemen doctors said Wednesday as the World Health Organization and International Committee of the Red Cross warned the disease was spreading Currently, there is an increase in diphtheria cases, due to the poor vaccination coverage for children under 5 years of age, an ICRC spokeswoman told AFP. The WHO also confirmed diphtheria cases had appeared in Yemen, where war and a port and airport blockade has left hospitals struggling to secure basic medical supplies including vaccines. In the port city of Hodeida, caught in the blockade by a state military coalition fighting Yemeni rebels, pediatrician Usana Lapsi at the Aldora Hospital said three people had died of diphtheria over the past 24 hours. We were surprised by the emergence of diphtheria cases here. We diagnosed and gave them emergency care as best we could, he said. Some of them were dying when they arrived. Local man Ibrahim al he said he had sold all of his possessions to pay for his family to be admitted after his five children and wife came down with what doctor suspected was diphtheria. His 11-year-old daughter, Yasmin, died on Wednesday morning. She had already been battling kidney failure when the doctor diagnosed her. The first one who got sick was Yasmin, and then her brothers and sisters. And then their mother got sick, Musba, he told AFP, adding he was also feeling some symptoms. My financial situation is so bad I sold everything for the sake of my kids. I just wish I could find someone to take care of to cure my kids. Diphtheria, a bacterial infection that is preventable by vaccine, attacks the nose and throat and if left untreated the heart and nervous system. While it is treatable, the infection can be deadly, particularly for children. The U.S.-based Mayo Clinic estimates up to 3% of those who contract diphtheria will die. More than 2,000 people have died of cholera in Yemen this year, adding to the 8,600 who have died in the conflict between the Sada-backed government and rebels since 2015. The blockade on Yemen's ports and airports, put in place after the Iranian-backed Hadi rebels fired a missile into Saudi territory, has tightened the stranglehold around Hodeida, a key conduit for much-needed food and medicine imports to Yemen. The United Nations has warned that unless the blockade is lifted, Yemen will face the largest famine the world has seen for decades. Copyright 2017 AFP